Hi, and welcome to another episode of Hot Takes with me, the Silver Fox. There's a guy called Ian Munro. He is in charge of Creative Scotland. That's the organisation that pumped nearly £100,000 into the old skin flick, facing lesbians mucking around up in the Highlands. Sounds like an excellent film, don't get me wrong. I'm not averse to that kind of thing in moderation. But I certainly don't think public money should be used to fund it and certainly not filmed out in such locations where people may unobtrusively be passing. Please let me have the details in advance in case I decide to go unobtrusive and pass. However, Ian Munro lied. He lied to the committee. He lied to the people of Scotland when he was talking about the film and what it contained, etc. Angus Robertson, for whom is responsible all these things, has decided it is in the interest of the Scottish people to not fire Ian Munro and let him carry on with his very, very highly paid quango job, even though he lies and spends money incorrectly and immorally. If I did that to my boss, I'd be down the road. In fact, I'm pretty sure that anyone who spent a lot of their company's money and then lied about it to their boss would also likewise be picking up the old P45 and heading out to the Dole office. Not in Scottish politics. No, no, lying and stealing is perfectly acceptable, so long as you obey the 11th commandment. Not, don't get caught, that goes without saying, it's the, thou shalt be a member of the SNP, and that way all your sins are forgiven. Deary me, what a world. Anyway, thanks very much for listening, take care and goodbye.